Welcome to one of our Alpha Laval 360 degree service and maintenance videos. With Alpha Laval service, you maximize the reliability and uptime of your equipment. The result is superior performance throughout the equipment life cycle. Performance that puts you ahead of competition. Here we will focus on how to conduct service and maintenance on standard Alpha Laval SMP BC mixed proof valves using our service kits with genuine spare parts. Remember always read the instruction manual thoroughly to cover all the maintenance steps since this video only shows you some of the steps. To maintain the standard Alpha Laval SMP BC mixed proof valves these tools are required. Each Alpha Laval service kit contains all the spare parts you need. How to replace product wetted seals. After dismantling the valve, remove all the product wetted seals. Then replace the seals, starting with a large plug seal. Lubricate the large seal ring and mount it correctly with a flat side up on the large inner guide ring. Please follow all of the steps outlined in the instruction manual. Place the plug tool housing on the drill column or in a hydraulic press. Insert the plug into the tool and place the large inner guide ring on the plug. Place the large outer guide ring onto the inner guide ring and press it firmly into place. Use the pin to lift the inner guide ring. Release the pressure on the drill column or the hydraulic press and then remove the large tool parts. Take the small seal ring and lubricate it. Then mount it with a flat side up onto the small inner guide ring. Please follow all the steps outlined in the instruction manual. Place the support tool onto the plug tool housing when the plug is in place. Place the small inner guide ring on top of the support tool and the outer small guide. Press down firmly. Then use the pin to lift the small inner guide. Release the pressure. Remove the plug from the tool and remember to release any trapped air from the back side of the plug seals with a small screwdriver. Be sure not to damage the seals and plug. Lubricate and replace the O-rings on the CIP detecting valve.
Next, lubricate and replace the lip seal. Be sure to position the body seal correctly and then reassemble the valve. 